This Sunday is Easter Sunday, which means a bunch of you will probably be participating in some fun Easter egg hunts. In fact, I've already started. I have found four eggs, and usually these eggs are filled with candy or some small fun toys. But these are actually very special, and these tell us what Easter is really all about. So inside the first egg, we find a little cross. And the cross reminds us that Jesus willingly carried his cross to Calvary to die for our sins. No one told him he had to do it. He just did it because he knew that that was the only way for us to get to heaven. God loves us so much that he sent his only begotten son so that we could have everlasting life. In the second one, we have three nails. The nails remind us how Jesus was nailed to the cross, but their nails weren't this tiny. They were much, much bigger. He suffered great pain as he was nailed into the cross. He suffered the pain to pay for our sins. In the third egg, we have a stone. The Bible tells us that when Jesus died, his body was placed in a tomb and a stone was rolled in front of the entrance. One Sunday morning, two women went to the tomb and they saw that the stone that was in front of the entrance was rolled away. The stone reminds us that even a huge stone can't keep Jesus in the grave. And for our last egg, it's empty. The Bible tells us that when the two women went inside the tomb, it was completely empty. Jesus was not there. The women thought that somebody might have stolen the body of Jesus. But inside the tomb, the woman found an angel who said to them, He is not here. He is risen, just as he said he would. Come see the place where he lay. The empty egg reminds us of Jesus' empty tomb. He is risen, just as he said. Jesus willingly took his cross, but he couldn't be held on the cross by nails, nor could he have been kept in a tomb by a large stone. He is risen and he lives in heaven with God, his Father. The Bible tells everyone who believes in him that they will join him in heaven with the Father. So a fun activity you can do is grab two popsicle sticks or any sticks. You can grab them from outside and decorate them as you want. You can draw on them, pom-poms, buttons, whatever you would like. Let's pray. We thank you, Father, that you loved us so much that you sent your only son to die for our sins. We are thankful that his story does not end with his death, but we serve a risen Savior. In Jesus' name we pray.